How to Active Directory Backup and Restore and Authoritative Restore in Server 2019 Go to Server Manager Click Add Roles and Feature Click Next Select Role Based and Feature Based Installation then click Next Click Next Click Next Scroll down. Select Windows Server Backup. Click Next. Click Restart the destination server automatically if required. Click on Yes. Click Install. Installation succeeded. Click on Close. Go to Tools. Scroll down. Click on Windows Server Backup. Click Local Backup. Click on Backup once. Click Different Option. Click Next. If you want to backup the entire server, you will choose Full Server. If you want to take backup as per your choice then choose Custom. I want to back up the Active Directory, so I will choose Custom. Click Next. Click Add Items. Choose System State. Click on OK. Click Next. In this option we have to choose where we should keep the backup of the Active Directory. If you want to keep backup on Network Drive, then you will choose Remote Location and if you want to backup on Local Drive, then you will choose Local Drives. I am choosing Local Drive in my case. Click Next. Click Next. Click on Backup. After completion backup process click on close. See the backup console. The backup was successfully generated. Close all consoles. Open this PC. Open drive. Open and check the AD backup folder. Go to Server Manager.
Go to Active Directory User and Computer. I am deleting some user and organization units here. So that when I restore the backup and check that the user and organization units are back, my backup restore is done. After deleting the user and O you close a DUC. Go to run and type GP update. Go to run and type. Type MS config then press enter. Click on boot. Click save boot and select active directory repair. Click on apply. Click on OK. Click restart. Log on as administrator. After log on go to server manager. Go to Tools. Scroll down. Select Windows Server Backup. Click Local Backup. Click on Recover. Click Next.
Select Backup Date then click Next. Select System State. Click Next. Select Perform an Authoritative Restore of Active Directory. Click Next. Click on OK. Click on Recover. Click on Yes. Click on Restart. Log on as administrator. Go to run and type. Type msconfig then press enter. Click on boot. Uncheck save boot. Click on apply. Click on ok. Click on restart. Log on as domain administrator. Go to Server Manager. Go to Tools. Go to Active Directory User and Computer. Expand Domain Name. We deleted the organization unit and some users. Now after restoring the backup, all of them are back which shows that the restoration of our backup has been done correctly. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.